to Simply Unluckier. And today, we're opening up the amazing, the epic, the classic Yu-Gi-Oh! Legendary Collection 2, The Duel Academy Years. And then we'll ask you guys to check out the channel and subscribe for more, more epic Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. And a couple quick things I wanted to talk about with you guys. Simply VIP program, you guys. We're doing a soft launch of international shipping. Um, so if you guys want to join up and work with us on some international shipping, our plan is to give you guys, of course, the wholesale prices. But uh, for shipping for international, we'll have to definitely um, just kind of work on that together and see how much it actually costs for the different countries and all of that stuff. There might be some other holes we'll have to go through, but uh, overall, uh, we can't really do anything until we start actually trying to do it and learning together with you guys how we can get the product to you. So, international shipping, Simply VIP program, is uh, it's now. It's happening now. Oh, baby. So, go check that out. Um, if you guys get a chance, I know a lot of you guys have been asking us if we can uh, start doing that. So, check that out. Also, uh, the giveaway winners for the Exodia video... Exodia! A Blu-ray! Are right there. There. Two winners. Uh, complete sets of the Lost Start promotion, Exodia. So, uh, thank you guys for participating in that. I know I wanted to obviously do the giveaway winners for that a little earlier. Um, but yes, you'll get your Lost Start promotion sets of Exodia. Very nice. Um, so, for this video, you guys, we're going to do a Legendary Collection Dual Academy Years. But we're also going to uh, do some Mega Malfors. So, let's do that. Here we go, you guys. First letter here. Ooh, looks like we have a return envelope. And a blue eyes white dragon. Hey, Simply, my name is Jones. Joneses. I think your content is great. And I always watch your openings on a set before I decide whether it's a good idea to purchase it or not. Congrats on the impressive 450,000 plus subscribers, almost 500,000. Best of luck to you, to your card shop. And inside, I have an envelope that I would greatly, highly appreciate if you were to sign a card for me and send it back. The best of luck in future openings. Jones. Sorry. Thank you, Jones, for sending that in. I might be mispronouncing your name, but I appreciate it. Nice handwriting as well. And uh, remember, you guys, uh, some of you guys have had some handwriting that I've been trying to, you know, uh, proofread before uh, doing the video and a lot of it I can't read so if you guys have really bad handwriting maybe try to print out a letter um, instead so I'm doing my best though here we go next one you guys thank you Jones for sending that in all right we got some cards hey there Roman I sent you a Mega Mail letter a while while back but I put together some awesome cards to send you for the Mega Mail binder recently you said you'd like to see some more epic Japanese cards so I found a few for you. Also, I really enjoy the fake cards that I sent you, and I think you'll really enjoy these ones as well. Also, if you could sign a Dark Magician and Blue Eyes, I would greatly appreciate it. And I bet you'll never guess what the backwards cards is. Leave comments down below. Keep up the great work. We all love watching you, and I hope that you keep making content for a very long time. Your friend, Danny Leo. Thanks, Danny. I remember your message before. All right, let's see what Danny sent today. I love the fake Japanese, I love it. Okay, backwards card will be last. Our first fake card here is a Master of the Dragon Knight. Not Dragon Master Knight, a Master of the Dragon Knight. If we're gonna get it to, there we go. Dragon Fusion Effect, Chaos Soldier and Blue Eyes Ultimate. Monster can only be special summoned by fusion. Increase the attack of this monster strength by 500 points for each other dragon subtype on the field. Not bad, pretty good English on that one. Next, we have a, a number 20 Giga Brilliant. Get all scratched off there. Scratched off the foil. I love those ultimates. Next, we have some Japanese cards. We have the X Head Cannon. Nice. Y Dragon Head and Z Metal Tank. Oh! And an XYZ Dragon. Um, yeah. Catapult Cannon. Am I close? Very cool. Japanese. And the Dark Magician and Blue Eyes. Okay, put that in our signed pile. Oh, face down card two. Oh! Ah, that was tricky there. That was a good one. <laughs> I bet you'll never guess. Did you actually put these together? I think so. I don't know. Very cool. That was tricky. That was good. 
I bet you'll never guess. That was a good one. <laughs> Danny Leo. I'm gonna remember that one, man. That was that was a good one. <laughs> okay. Here we go. We'll set these to the side. Thanks again, Danny, for sending some hashtag more mega mail. Uh, we got a few more here, you guys, and then we'll get to the uh, legendary collection binder. Open last, open first. Um, okay. So it says here it was small writing, but it is printed. Dear Simple and Lucky, my name is Aaron, and I'm from California. First of all, I want to say thanks for the countless hours of entertainment your channel has provided me with. You are by far the greatest Yu-Gi-Oh card unboxer on YouTube, in my opinion. And I've watched a few other guys, and honestly, I don't like as much the enthusiasm as much as I enjoy yours. It really does matter when you take the time to read the card or explain the effect and give those who aren't familiar with some of the new content a better understanding of the cards. My favorite video by far was Such for the Golden Castle. And I was amazed by how many boxes you had to open and you still didn't pull it. Me too. Me too. Um, I was a bit jealous though of how many Neo support cards you pulled as they were my favorite archetype. Awesome. Uh, thank you again for all the great content you provide us with and I hope and you and your channel and the best. Last but not least, best of luck opening your card shop and I hope I can visit one day. Please accept this small token of gratitude as an appreciation for all the nostalgic memories you have provided me with. Kaiba! Sincerely, Aaron. P.S. I included some special stuff for hashtag more mega mail and a lucky charm. Okay. Aaron, good guy. Nice message, dude. I appreciate that. Okay, first we got some cool cards here. Ooh, maybe some more fake cards. Okay. Lightly played for my chill hit away. Uh, first off, we have a fake black feather elfin pitch of black. When there is black feather monster face up on field, this card can be summoned without release. When this card successfully summoned, you can't special change mode a monster on the field. Okay. Aqua Spirit, nice. Card can only be special summoned by removing water monster in the grave from play as long as monster remains face up. Oh, that's a good English on that one. Earthbound God Kapak Apu. Only one earthbound. God monster can be face up on the field. Destroy this monster when they're not face up. Field magics. Opponent cannot choose this card as target of attack. This card can attack opponent directly. When this card destroys opponent's monster's battle, deal damage to opponent equal half attack strength and destroy that monster. Black Skull Dragon has a fake one. That's cool. Summon Skull and Red Eyes B. And Fairy Guardian. Offer one face up card tribute as magic card sent to your graveyard opponent during this turn bottom of the deck. Cool. Awesome fake cards there. And then we had a card face down again. I wonder if it's going to be a face down, face down card. That would be interesting. Ooh, Kaiba token. Okay. And then we have some super uh, taped up cards here. Okay, Aaron, let's see. Take it out of that one. It's going to be our leader cards for hashtag main mail battles. Oh, it's a golden castle. Oh, snap dizzle pop. Honestly, I can't believe somebody actually sent it in. That is sweet. Aaron, thank you so much, man. Finally, we found the golden castle. Oh, it's another golden castle. <laughs> Oh, that's so awesome. Aaron, you're the man, dude. I Honestly, nobody has sent one, and we still haven't pulled one, so it's cool to see it. I know we still need to search for it. All right, guys, we, we have to find our old Golden Castle, but it's still nice to see Aaron's Golden Castle because obviously he's pulled two of them. So, uh, Aaron, thank you so much for sending it in. We can make, make the, what's it called, Golden Castle of Stormbird deck for our uh, Mega Mail battles. And again, you guys, all cards you send in, of course, will not be getting rid of, thrown away, sold. So, I appreciate that. Golden Castle. That was cool. And then open the last. So, it looks like this is the Lucky Charm. It is a Millennium Necklace. Or Millennium Ring. Okay. Alright then. Aaron went ahead and sent me a personal message at the end. But basically, he's just saying, uh, I hope you enjoyed the cards that I threw in there. And uh, it brought a smile to your face. It definitely did, Aaron. That was a good one. Thanks, man, for sending these in. Awesome. Millennium Ring, right? So, Aaron sent this. Set those there. Okay. Go ahead and set those to the side. That was a good one. Thanks, Aaron. 
Much appreciated. Enjoy the feeling you put into your words. All right, you guys. And uh, last but not least here, we'll do one more Mega Mail. Go ahead. And uh, we'll do a Thunderball. Millennium Thunderball. <laughs> Bit of a longer message. Oh, nice. Obelisk of the Tormentor and Prime Material Dragon. We were just talking about Prime Material Dragon for those Tsukiyomi decks. All right, here we go. Howdy, Simple and Lucky. I've been subscribed to your channel for a long while now, but I finally decided that it was time to send you some mail for everybody's favorite hashtag more Mega Mail videos. Oh, baby. Included is a bundle containing uh, three cards that have meaning to me. The first is my ace monster, Prime Material Dragon, whose power scuffs at burn decks while potentially protecting your own monsters on the field. If you ever are in need, feel free to call upon this monster. The second card was actually my first card, Mega Thunderball. So he must be in there. Um, Mega Thunderball from MRD. My first deck wasn't any good, as you can imagine. <laughs> Last but not... Certainly not least is my favorite of the Egyptian gods and one you've called upon in your war of the gods with Alex Obelisk the Tormentor. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> Still a little sick. I, I, <coughs> I don't know if you've seen the movie art before, but I went out of the way to get one so you can experience the power of the gold seeker rare. Do I hear thunder? If you guys remember in the videos, do you guys hear some thunder? Because Obelisk is coming. Best of luck and skill in all your endeavors. Having faced the legendary Blue Eyes White Dragon, live to tell the tale. I doubt there's any obstacle you can't overcome. Oh, that's cute. I love it. I uh, can't wait to see more duels with Alex along with those Rare Hunter videos, especially Naruto cards. I've collected them crazy back in the day. I very much appreciate the use of old school rules and card effects. Keep things epic. Try a Battle Pack 1 booster box sometime. I think the shenanigans would make for an insane godly duel. Sincerely, your fellow duelist, Jay. Like this letter. <laughs> like the letter. P.S. Best of luck getting the secret rare blue eyes. Shining Dragon. We had to stop opening Retro Pack. It was too expensive. Oh, man. Jay. Awesome letter, my friend. Awesome letter. And uh, that is taped, so I don't know if we'll get the Mega Thunderball out for now, but we know you sent one in there. The Millennium Thunderball. Awesome letter, my friend. Okay, you guys. Going straight into Legendary Collection 2, the Duel Academy years. Um, this is kind of leading up to hopefully our Jade and Yusei battle. The issue now is Alex um, is working full time and he wasn't before. So it's just a matter of trying to get him over here. Because you know sometimes friends want to hang out and they don't want to just duel. But uh, I'll get him over here. We'll do it. We'll get it done. But uh, yeah, actually Legendary Collection 2 Duel Academy Years is one, becoming one of the more rare products in Yu-Gi-Oh. So this is actually pretty exciting. And for those that don't know, there there is multiple, or there's another type of uh, Legendary Collection 2, which is in a box. The binder itself is actually pretty hard to find and is getting more valuable. So, good to note. This is the European edition. You can tell by the cards being a little more darker. And uh, Uria, Hammond, Ravia Lords, Phantasm, the Sacred Demon Beasts. And then you have your packs over here. First edition Mega, Ma Mega Packs. I believe the reprinted um, boxes... The Mega Pack 2 boxes are not first edition, but maybe you guys can cor correct me if I'm wrong. And let's get straight into it. Thanks to our friends at Olds Pro, we have the white Pro Mat sleeves over here. And let's do this. Wow, it's been a while. Woo! Puh, that is a funky smell. Whoa. <laughs> smell like ink. All right. Decounter, first edition. Uh, Legendary Collection. Actually, I kind of want to just take these out of here. And uh, we'll actually go ahead and open the promos too because we haven't seen those. Was there a... No. Okay, we'll leave that right there covering up Kaiba because he's sad. All right, Decounter, Neospatian Hummingbird. And a good thing about this video or this uh, pack right now is, you know, Neospatians are kind of making a little bit of a comeback. All the hero cards coming out. So this is pretty cool opening, I feel like, uh, leading up to maybe a Jade and Yusei battle here. Uh, Neo Spatians, Six Samurai Yaichi, my boo, my bae, uh, Space Gift, Rainbow Gravity, Rosebud, a Cyber Dragon First Edition, wow, LCGX from the European edition of Legendary Collection 2. That seems like it'd be rare, but you never know. A uh, Destiny Hero Dreadmaster, and wow, Khmer Tech Over Dragon. That's actually really cool. Very three very cool cards, you guys. 
Dang, this first edition. Man, maybe I shouldn't open these. These seem like extremely rare. Oh well. We're committed. Uh, let's go ahead and sleeve the Chimera Tech over Dragon. Okay, so we got a few epic cards there. Next pack here. Actually, we'll just set them on here. Next pack. Uh, here, let's go ahead and open up our Dark Lord promo variant pack here. Dark Lord Asmodeus, Superbia, Ede Ara, <laughs> Cyber Larva, uh, Lion Alligator, Spawn Alligator, Elemental Hero, Great Tornado, Parallel World Fusion, Dragonic Tactics, and the Court, the Court of Justice. All right, you guys. Four more packs here from this actually pretty dang rare first edition set. Uh, some of the rarest packs, I would say, for Legendary Collections. Elemental Hero Flare Neos. That's pretty common, but still pretty. Uh, e Emergency Call. Nice. I think that's actually one of the more valuable versions. Because I know, well, first edition secret from Legendary Collection, but still, as a common. Uh, Thunder King Ryo. Nice. Elemental Hero Bub -Bub -Bub Bubble Man. D Shield. Gladiator Proving Grounds. Rare. Cool. A White Knight Dragon. First edition. Elements Hero Aquanios and Gladiator Beast Darius first edition freaking from the dual cat. I just want to keep saying a legendary collection to European edition. That is actually extremely cool looking. Uh, makes me want to play Gladiator Beast because he would definitely be played in the deck. Wow, that is pretty. That is very pretty. I know cards somehow, you know, don't really have value just because they're not really played, but as a just a card, mint condition, secret rare, reprint, or highest rarity of Darius, Glider Beast Darius, that is really cool. Um, next pack. Let's go get into this here. Some more Glider Beast would be really cool. I mean, I'm a big fan. Definitely a deck I played in my prime, along with Six Samurais, of course. Crystal Beast Amber Mammoth, Venom Swamp Black Wings, DD Survivor, Infernal Gainer Evil Hero, Crystal Pair, Evil Hero Infernal Prodigy. Ooh, Elemental Hero Electrum First Edition Ultra. That's pretty. Holy guacamole, man. A Destiny Hero End Dragon and Skyscraper 2 Hero City. Another high rarity of a uh, GX card. That's really cool. Electrum is pretty sweet as well. Go ahead and sleeve up those bad boys. Two more packs. I like the white pro mats for this GX themed video. All right, here we go. Two more packs. You guys believe in the cards? Give it to us. Kaiba! Here we go. Oh, I love how the sickness is kind of going away. It's, it's, it's getting there. Transcendent Wings. Righteous Justice. Blade Master. Elemental Hero Wild Edge. Nice. Andal. This guy's the one eyed warrior. It's an aggressive hunter that strikes down its prey with the powerful swipes of its claws. Bubble, the bubble shuffle, the bubble shuffle, and crystal tree for our ultra rare. That's a really cool, honestly. If you're playing crystal beast and you actually want to play that card, you might play one. DD Crow super rare actually holds some value, but the ultimate rare is still the best. Ooh, secret rare elemental hero shining flare wingman. Oh baby, that is pretty. First edition, European edition. Holy wow. That is a very cool. Look at that freeze frame right there. Boom, boom, screenshot, boom, boom. Very cool. Wow. That's probably one of the prettiest hero cards you can get out of here for sure. Uh, DD Crow, another actually pretty valuable card. Again, you guys, like the values on these is not, I feel like you, you don't really know, you know? You don't really know. Um, all right, here we go. Last pack of Destiny, if you guys can please. But please believe in the heart of the cards so that we can pull very cool. You know what would be the best, honestly, is a first edition European. Um, or do I get confused? Is it not in this set? I feel like I get confused. Uh, really? It's the fusion of the three demon beasts. I'm not going to remember right now, but you know. Orbitile the Chaos Phantom. I am going to remember. Chamberlain of the Six Samurai. Supported by the Shadows. Elemental Hero Neos, nice. First edition common from this pack is kind of rare. The new hero that arrived from Neospace, he's a new hero. Clayman, who protects his colleagues at all costs. We've seen it. We've seen it in our Lost Millennium opening. The dude was destroyed. 
and he still protected his cards behind him. Fear Monger, Neospatian Glow Moss, Overload Fusion, Dark Fusion, that's pretty sweet. Dark Lord Desire. Here we go, Secret Rare. Ooh, Wing Kribo level 10. That's cool. Nice. All right, you guys. So that is it for this opening. Um, again, we can't do these very often, so it's really cool to open up a Legendary Collection 2 Dual Academy years. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that, because I definitely did, leading up to maybe some more Jaden packs, and then we'll move into some Yusei openings, and then hopefully get a duel, some deck profiles and duel for you guys, because that would be epic. Um, but yes, and again, thanks to all those epic people <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, who sent in hashtag more Mega Mail. Uh, you guys are awesome. And some really expressive letters today. I uh, really enjoyed that. And uh, of course, if you guys want to send hashtag more Mega Mail, there is a P.O. Box in the description below. Also, uh, international shipping for Simply VIP program. You guys, check it out. Uh, we are now sending international. We haven't really done any updates yet. Um, I first need to kind of figure out shipping, prices, and all that stuff to work with you guys. Um, so there won't be any free shipping for international orders. But we'll work together, have some holes to go through, do some digging. We'll figure it out. And as always, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the content. Subscribe for more epic Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, and simply unlucky signing out.